Hello, here is a project of automatic school bell. Main components of projects are this chip 8051 chip 8089S502. It has four different parties, ports. There are eight bits in each port. Port number one of 8051 is attached with 4x3 matrix keypad port number 2 of microcontroller with bit 0 and bit 1 means pin number 21 and pin number 22 is connected with APROM and RTC RTC means real time clock while APROM means non volatile memory we are using 24C02 ok these both chip are attached in serial communication mode with 8051 with 2 wire interface here is a LCD for user interface we can see time and alarm numbers and other details on this LCD which is connected in 4 bit mode which is wired in 4 bit mode means 4 data bits are used while lower 4 bits are grounded and RS and enable pin is connected with microcontroller all these 6 pins are attached with microcontroller via port number 0 while the bell is connected at port number 2 the pin number 2.5 2.5 is out active low output pin which is made by software active low output of this pin is attached with one PNP transistor and output of this transistor from the collector of it is connected with NPN transistor which drives the relay and drives the buzzer or a bell what we need when the output of the microcontroller at pin number, pin number 2.5 is high then the PNP transistor Q2 is in off state mode because it is PNP transistor and base is positive so it do not uh, come in on state it uh, remains in off state so the NPN transistor uh, is in off state also so the bell is not ringing if this pin is become low active low then the PNP transistor becomes in uh, becomes high it means it becomes in on state so the VCC supply from here VCC supply 5 volt comes here and then uh, through 1 kilo ohm register it gives a forward bias current to NPN transistor induce the if the pin 2.5 becomes low then the output of this transistor at collector becomes low so the ground available from here to here and the positive 12 volt is available from power supply so the relay is on when the 2.5 number pin is 0 and relay becomes off when this pin is 1 so this is the project work here are crystal oscillator this C1 and C2 are resonant filter of this crystal oscillator reset capacitor reset switch reset register these two switches are for time and alarm setting this switch is for alarm setting this switch is for time setting or vice versa uh, this is non volatile memory here are two pull up registers for serial communication and this is main pull up register for LCD it will give additional power supply to the LCD because 8051 have no internal pull up uh, register at port number 0 now we will start the project use the project work Okay. 
now it is in up state because the pin is high and the relay is not working so the buzzer or motor is in off state if we press this switch it will ask us for a time we have to remove it also now we have to press address first of all we will set address number 0 0 so the alarm time 0 now we have to enter time we will enter time in 24 hour format 0 9 0 0 0 0 so the alarm time 0 means the first alarm time is in set in aprom which is 9 o'clock now we will set another time address 0 1 now time in 24 hour format 0 9 3 0 0 0 time is set ok if we want to set a clock time we have to press this switch and then we have to release it after releasing the switch the clock time will be asked we will add 0 8 5 9 0 0 date today's date 18 0 4 1 5 day today is 7th day of the week Saturday so it is showing time 8.59 Saturday this will start on 9 o'clock we have to, to restart system after setting all the alarm timings we have to set alarm time again zero one zero nine two six zero zero goes out so we don't want it is set again so juice, juice the time is set and then it will ring